AITA for exposing a man's criminal past in front of his new wife after he made a hurtful comment about my loss. So, this is going to be long, and I will try to include the details as best I can. This happened a month ago, and it's still echoing in my head. When I, 26F, was 21, I was in an abusive and toxic relationship with a man we'll call Mitch, fake name, 35M at the time. Mitch was friends with this guy, who we'll call Sean, fake name, 38 at the time, a recovering alcoholic. Sean always gave me bad vibes. I knew that Mitch met Sean in jail, but I never pried about why he was there. Mitch told me that he was in jail for a bar fight, I was naive and believed him. A few months into the relationship, I got pregnant but ultimately lost the baby. Around this time, my parents started hearing rumors about Mitch. They asked me for his birthday and full name, and it turns out he was a registered sex offender and had done time for crimes involving minors. I left him immediately and even checked the registry myself. Not much of a surprise that I found Sean listed, mugshot and all, also for similar offenses. I have since moved on and am happily married in a completely different county. Last week, my husband and I were visiting family in my hometown when we came across Sean in a store. We did our best to avoid him, but he walked right up to me and my husband while we were at checkout and had the nerve to ask me, where's the kid, knowing full well I had a miscarriage all those years ago. I saw red. At that moment, I realized he was there with a woman who was with two special needs adults, both female. I saw the rings and asked her, how could you trust a man like that around them, because it was very clear that both were non-verbal, as they could barely even call her mom. Sean immediately got tense, and his wife asked me what I meant. So I told her. This resulted in her googling the registry and proceeding to walk out of the store with her daughters in tow. Luckily, my husband stepped in before Sean could say anything else. I've heard through the grapevine that she has started divorce proceedings, and now Sean has started drinking again. I brought this up with someone, and they said there were better ways to handle this than how it happened, but I don't know. I just need an outside opinion.